good morning it's Jess welcome back for another video so today I'm gonna to be working on several drainage issues that I have around my property y'all I'm trying to get like all of my infrastructure and digging up the yard all of that work done before I start making it pretty so yeah I have two different types of drainage systems that I'm going to be installing on either side of my house and we do have several rainstorms planned in the forecast so I apologize in advance if this is a little bit jumpy this will probably be over the course of the week and yeah, let me just go ahead and show you guys what I'm working on. Hey babies, happy birthday. My babies are too, y'all. So of course I need to grab all the supplies. I've got most of them from Lowe's. I've got a T coupler here. I also bought a Y. These are the connections to the downspout. And then also a few couplers. And then I also got a pop-up drain so the water can run out into the streets. And then of course the big corrugated pipe. So let's go ahead and get to work. Here's just a few progress pics of me digging out the trench on the east side of my house. I did not film the digging for you guys just because it's pretty self-explanatory. Found another snake. Always. I can never dig without finding one. So I finished this trench up in about two and a half hours. It was a nice cool day, clear skies, 50 degrees, perfect for digging. And then a couple days later, I started digging on the west side of my house. This is between me and my neighbor, and I'll be connecting our two downspouts over here. So here I am just correcting a mistake I made. I initially dug this trench out as a T connection, and I want this to be a Y. So I'm just shaving off a little bit of the edge to make this a diagonal. expecting a lot of rain so I'm going to try to get as much done as I can as possible before the rain comes but here we are on the west side of my house as you guys can see I have already dug out most of the trench nice trench work going on here I did this a couple days ago so basically what I'm going to be doing is burying my downspout here running it underground it's going to run down and it'll connect with my neighbor's downspout and we'll run the water out down that way just because because of my grading and my house is so much higher than hers this just stays really wet and muddy well before the mud was here it still was wet when we had grass here so that's the plan is to run the water away from the house and out down to the street so I'm gonna go ahead and set up the camera and I'll just show you guys what it looks like after issues with just standing water on this side of the house I just decided to use regular solid corrugated pipe nothing with any slits or holes just something solid to run that water all the way down the hill and away from the house first half of this pretty much done I ran an elbow from my downspout I need to go and get a screw so I can secure it to that just ran the pipe underneath these wires here you always want to make sure you go underneath any wires that you're working with it runs down around the corner and then it runs straight down here and it connects with the Y so that this water coming from here will run kind of in the same direction instead of it running this way and then having to turn and go left. So 
he is working on digging the rest of the trench and once that's done I'll connect the rest out and put up the pop-up so I'm gonna work on backfilling while he is digging all right y'all so we actually decided to stop with the pop-up here just because this is a huge brick of concrete that we can't get out and I think it'll be fine if it ends here so the drain just ends right here runs along this way he's already in the process of backfilling for me it wise off to her house and then snakes up this way up to my downspout here and we just need to connect this one and put the screws on so yeah all right you guys so this drainage system is pretty much done for now I'm gonna go ahead and stop here just because do y'all see these clouds we about to get a downpour so let me wrap this up really really quick so pretty much all we ended up doing was attaching here to my downspout he did put in a screw on each side to hold it in place he did also have to build this up just a little bit so it had a nice down flow um, I will have to go in and replant two of my lambs here that I had to dig up back in this space this will be going away and then I tried to put in some pieces of side back that I dug out but we'll pretty much be reseeding this entire area it runs down the hill around the curve here and then it does also connect to her drain curves this way into a y to run down this way and we ended the pop-up here as i showed you guys before there was a big piece of concrete that this is sitting on so basically the water will flow and this will pop up so that the water can drain continuing down the hill out to the street so I am so excited to see how this works. We're about to get a rainstorm, so it's perfect to test this out. But yeah, we're gonna come in with some nice garden soil and compost, till that in, get this leveled out to reseed, cause y'all, I'm so sick of looking at this mess. Check out these big boulders. Like, here's my hand, look at that, huge. So yeah, once we started hitting these big rocks, I was like, no, we're just gonna end the trench here. So yeah, that's pretty much it for this project. I do have another drainage system I'm working on the back, which I will show you guys uh, probably tomorrow because it'll be sunny. So good night for now, and I'll see you guys tomorrow morning. All right, you guys. So it's raining, and yes, I'm in the rain, but I wanted to see just how much water this is catching. So here's my downspout off the side of my house. This is where I have started trenching. And I'm going to be running drainage pipes all the way down out of my fence. You can see where I stopped. Look how much water is building up in here, y'all. This is gallons of water. So this is why I'm burying my downspouts. Um, as you can see, down this way, this is where the water is just running out and it's starting to wash away. You can see all that surface water there. So I need to continue the trench underneath the fence and then just have it run out that way. I do have two craters forming again. So yeah, I need to hurry up and get this seated. So just wanted to give you guys that perspective. Oh my gosh, that's so much water. Yeah, definitely we'll be adding some drainage here.